quick rundown for anybody who's never been to an antique mall before. It is basically a giant mall full of antiques. There's a bunch of different dealers who set up their own little stores all throughout one big giant antique mall. Because dealers set their own prices, they can be all over the map. But I find some really, really good deals here. You'll come across booths that say things like, make me an offer, or they'll have a big sale. Sometimes they'll have really great closeout prices on certain items. But it's huge and they have everything. You get the idea. They have furniture and dishware and glassware and jewelry. Oh, by the way, ladies, so much jewelry this time. I'm going to take you through it in no particular order, and I made it maybe halfway through this place, so I'll have to go back and do a whole nother one of these. I'm Tanya, by the way, and if you enjoy antique flea markets, thrift shopping, yard selling and garage selling, the list goes on. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button. We'd love to have you join our happy little family, and if you get a chance, you can always check out some more of my videos. I've listed some of my most recent and favorites in the description box below. Okay, laugh at me if you want, but I think this little Italian ceramic Dalmatian is the cutest thing, hands down, I saw on my trip here. I didn't take him home because he was almost $200, but I am going to keep my eye out at the antique and vintage flea markets that are local for me. A lot of those vendors have a booth right here in this antique mall, and you never know, my Dalmatian might just pop up for cheaper somewhere else. How cool is this? It's a bowling ball. You open it up and it's got all your stuff for drinks in there. What is that called? A mini bar, right? 
That painting was so captivating, but it's really small for $200. I'm going to see if I can do any better on price, but oh, it's going to hurt my heart to leave it. I'm trying to get enough pieces together to make a picture wall for my hallway, so I'm a lot more focused on quantity than quality right now. Sorry about the heavy breathing, by the way. I'm in California. It's still pretty smoky here, and it really takes a toll on my breathing. By the way, how is everybody else doing? I really hope everyone else is okay, everyone's safe, everyone made it through unscathed, through all of our recent natural disasters. This booth was so amazing. Not everything was something that I like, but there was plenty that was on sale for between five and $10. Some of them down from $55 or more. This was one of my favorite booths. I loved the oil paintings here. They were just gorgeous, and they have kind of that dark, mysterious vibe that people are really looking, looking to buy these days.
This was my other favorite booth. This was everything I love and can't afford. There were four or five oil paintings in here that just made my heart flutter. I wanted to take them home so badly, but they all had a tag somewhere around $1,000 or more. But that's okay. I still got to enjoy them in their natural habitat, the antique store. This piece here was actually not priced too terribly bad, and it just oozes Parisian to me. I loved it. I might go back for it. Check out these mermaid vases. These are so phenomenal.
the brass tie backs had me swooning. Look at these gorgeous beauties. Now I want a ballroom with nothing but curtains and these tie backs on every single window. Well, and some gorgeous chandeliers on the ceiling, of course. I mean, what's a ballroom without giant chandeliers, right? Go big or go home. Ugh, I can't even watch it, especially lower right with the flowers and this one right here. I'll probably go back a million times just to look at them.
sorry I'm not showing myself, but I'm a hot, sweaty mess from the day. It's still, still hot here in California, but everything I got here was from that one booth that had tons of stuff on sale for five and ten dollars. It was so incredible. That one in the middle is nice and light, so it's not going to hurt the wall. Isn't that cute? They're going to be so pretty. Thank you so much for coming with me. You make every one of my excursions infinitely more fun. Until next time, happy thrifting.